Hi everybody, Dr. Kirsty Broder of Kirsty Broder Aesthetics. I was at a um, business meeting today with a number of lovely ladies, all with their own businesses. It was basically a networking event. And as we went around the table to introduce ourselves and talk about the, the role that we have in our business, one of the ladies raised a, um, a really good question to me actually. And she said, I see so many young, like 20 year old, um, girls having treatments nowadays and I, I think it's too early and in a way she's right because 20 years old is quite young to be having aesthetics treatments however it's it's legal over the age of 18 it's completely legal for somebody to come and have aesthetic treatments and and that's up to them that is their choice um now whether it's too early for you to have aesthetic treatments is, is really a personal choice. There's so many benefits to starting aesthetics treatments at an earlier age. Um, there are some very key preventative mechanisms that can take place to, to delay um, the inevitable aging process. So starting your aesthetic treatments earlier on can be beneficial from a preventative perspective. Now that doesn't mean that it's right for everyone. And within my clinic, um, the demographic of my clients tends to be women who are 35 plus, um, 70 year old is, is, is my upper age limit at the moment. And um, that doesn't mean to say that anybody older than 70 can't come. Um, there's definitely people out there who would seek treatment um, 70 plus. Uh, it's just that my demographic is at the moment 35 to about 70. Um, and so a lot of the cases that I am treating is not preventative aesthetics. Um, what I'm doing is very much restoration and reparative uh, aesthetic treatments because the damage has already been done from our earlier years. Um, I think there's been a key shift nowadays in that we're a little bit more aware of the importance of wearing sunscreen to prevent the harmful effects of aging from the UV rays. And we've switched on a little bit more to the benefits of using uh, effective skincare as well. But certainly when I was younger, I did very little for my skin. I relied on the fact that I looked quite young and I was you know, quite lucky in that way. Um, how, and But then those pesky signs of premature ageing, the wrinkles and everything else that comes with it starts to creep up on you and all of a sudden you're like, oh my God, now I've got to do something. So we're almost caught on the back foot trying to reverse um, and repair damage which has been done because we didn't do anything at an earlier age. Now, with the benefit of hindsight now and the younger people coming through, they really switched on to how important skincare is, um, to have a good skincare routine, also wearing sunscreen on a daily basis. There's been a shift in diet, there's been a shift away from smoking, um, alcohol consumption as well. So generally the younger people coming through um, are living better and living healthier and probably will look younger as a result because they're starting their anti-aging processes at a much earlier age than, than certainly I did. Um, so there is the legal age limit, so 18 plus. Uh, like I say, in my clinic, my demographic is very much um, reparative, um, kind of time-stopping almost, and regenerative aesthetic medicine. But there is quite a heavy focus on preventative aesthetics as well, um, particularly coming through from, from the younger ages. So Within my clinic, I'm not working necessarily with the beautification side, um, big lips, you know, beautifying faces. That's that's not really where my focus is. With the demographic of my clients, it is reparative and a restorative type aesthetics, um, which I love doing. Um, it really gives me an awful lot of uh, satisfaction to really help my patients, my clients to feel better in themselves because we're helping them to improve their, their outward appearance. So it makes a massive difference what I do with the, with the aesthetic treatments that I carry out. When is the right time for you to start aesthetic treatments? That is, that is absolutely up to you. Some people may never ever have an aesthetic treatment in their life. My mum certainly is one of those people, um, despite what I do, uh, she won't ever have anything put in her face. Um, but for me, I started with my aesthetic treatments a, a few years ago and I've been feeling the benefits. Um, and, and really, the best time to start is, is absolutely a personal one. If you would like to talk a little bit more about 
aesthetics or skincare treatments which can help you, then I would love to offer a consultation for you. So you can either drop me a message um, or pop to my website where you can book your consultation. Um, and I would love to chat a little bit more with you about how I could help.